Yeah, let's go that DTX straight on that. Ali and I both love tuna fishing, but there's a certain type of tuna that you don't get to see too often. I know a little bit about this tuna fishery here through friends, and what I do know is, is there's a lot of them. They've got really cool sickle fins, and you get to fish it alone. Fiji is host to one of the tunas we love to chase, the yellowfin tuna particularly the one with the big Allison fins. It's just a different looking, different type of yellowfin tuna, and they're just absolutely gorgeous. So what are you looking for, bird piles to go run on? Or? Yeah, so just sort of driving a, a couple of miles at a time, and then just really having a look around in the area, and I'm looking for, you know, some type of feature, you know, whether it's birds or, you know, maybe a current line or some weed or something like that. Our tuna fishery here at Namotu um, is really driven by the sea surface temps. So that's the first thing I look at, okay? Where is the good water? Where do I think the bait is gonna be holding? Oh, I just saw it turn over here, flash and hit the water. So I go to that point and then we do a lot of glassing, you know, with gyros. From that point, I'm starting to look for birds, current lines, you know, like any little features out there that is gonna give me some information to tell me that there's tuna there. We're going this way, which is south from the island. All the birds are kind of congregating this way. Sort of looks good on the sea surface uh, temps as well, so. Tuna fishing is tuna fishing is tuna fishing. Everybody's got their own little take on it, but for the most part, it's a very visual type of fishing. Look at this over here now, it's foaming hard on the other side. Is that skipjack? That's, that's, that's skipjack right there. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And look at this bait. The bait is thick. Typically, you know, what happens here is the skipjacks bring all the bait up to the surface and they start foaming and that's when the bigger yellowfin come around, come around on the outskirts and just start pumping the skipjack. When we're out here cruising around, we're looking for birds primarily. Like birds give away the position of the fish. And those birds don't even have to be flying or diving. I mean, they are a telltale sign. Whether they're rafted up, whether they're in the sky, whether they're diving, birds are your telltale sign. Yellowfin right here, guys. You'll get a shot here. Okay, Rush, I'm gonna take the boat out of gear, so it's all you now, bro. Oh, look at the yellow fish jumping fish. right there. Big yep. fish. You saw a big fish? That was a schoolie right there. I saw. No, I saw big I, fish on the surface rolling. That got hit as well. Damn. Ooh, this one's dumping. <laughs> look at that. Oh, what? Oh, keep it oh. going. You know, when you are tuna fishing, there's really a couple of different ways you're gonna catch them on the same stop. Oh, he's on it. Oh my God. Oh, right in the boat. Get another cast out. I didn't want to pick it up. He was so high. We're gonna roll into a school of tuna again, pretty much anywhere in the world. We're typically dragging something behind the boat and then we're gonna have some kind of other offering for the fish, throwing lures at these fish. Which, you got the right kind there, Rechi? Oh, I'm just looking at this foamer. I don't know how big it is, but... Oh, God, they keep missing. That was a smaller fish. Yeah, on the outs, oh, oh, there he is. You got him? Yeah, small guy. That was a little guy, huh? Dang, that first one was not little. That was like yeah, one... Yeah, that was a proper one, 150 eh? class. Love catching tuna on top water. That's one of the most exciting ways to catch them. Oh, I just lost him. That's fine. Ooh, this feels like a good one now. Yeah, it's, it's a good right fish, guy. that one. Ooh, look and... at that. Okay, Rush, I'm with you now, so you just tell me what you need. No, I'm good right here. And once we get into them, I'm huge about topwater uh, casting for these fish. I love fishing for them with stick baits and poppers. It's such an amazing sight to see them explode on, um, you know, your topwater. I'm it. Oh, off. Again, on again. Again, they're eating it underwater. Totally tail hook, look at the tip. Oh, you beat me to death. Oh, perfect, no. Oh, he's tail wrapped. Broke off. This is good fish, hey? Feels like it. Yeah. 